some BL cars were quite badly built. But most weren't built at all. This is because the workforce spent most of its time outside on strike. But still, we say that despite all this, some good cars did sneak through the net. And we were going to prove it. I was full of hope, right up to the end of the slip road leaving Warwick services. My throttle's broken. My throttle's broken. Oh, God. Hammond's in trouble already. I got 100 yards and it's broken! I can't make the... Throttle doesn't work! In the lopsided Princess, James was unaware of my demise. I think British cars of the 1970s were good. We had this, we had Jeremy's Rover, great car. The Dolomite Sprint that Hammond's got, great car. They've given us these little cameras to film our various calamities, and we were expecting car problems, and we've already got them, but um, there's another one here, Jeremy's finger. I was just saying, well, it was in here. Has anyone got any butter? With some AA wire and some AA lure pack, Jeremy and I were soon on our way. And quickly we caught up with James so we could reflect on the brilliance of our cars. Some great details on this thing, like the seatbelt warning light, which flashes if you sit in the seat but don't put the seatbelt on. That sounds perfectly every day now, but back then, that was radical. And annoying, because seatbelts weren't compulsory. It's almost as though this car was designed by futurologists. I mean, this little slot down here is the exact size of a mobile phone. Tomorrow's world never even saw the mobile phone coming in, yet Rover did. And here, look, the door mirrors are operated by this switch, OK? Now, the people who put that switch there knew it would break, so they put manual controls in as well. Here comes Hammond, he's coming through. I shall now engage my fully functioning overdrive by pressing this button. Nothing's out. To get our first challenge, we've been told to go to the old Morris factory in Oxford. Unfortunately, when we got there, we found the plant now belongs to BMW, who told us to go away. <laughs> <laughs> 